Rear Admiral Musa in his keynote address on the topic, reflecting on 2023, a retrospective view of evolving threats landscape in Nigeria, noted that the Federal Capital Territory is also grappling with its fair share of insecurity despite being the seat of government. He said the outer suburbs of FCT can be prone to varying levels of crimes with kidnapping and one-chance robberies as the most prevalent. The activities of criminal gangs in FCT, the Federal Territory, is also grappling with its fair share of its security, despite being the seat of government. The outer suburb of FCT can be prone to various levels of crime, with kidnapping at one chance, the popularly known as one chance, which is another form of robbery, as the most prevalent. One chance is a slang for a situation where armed robbers pretending to be a commercial cab driver fellow passenger, pick other or suspected passenger, rob them of their valuables, and most times push them violent out of their moving vehicle. One chance probably sometimes involving dangerous weapons such as knife and firearms have been on the increase in recent months and spread from the outer suburb to more central and metropolitan areas of the capital city. While acknowledging the government's efforts towards tackling insecurity in Nigeria, the national coordinator said the Nigerian armed forces and other security agencies have sustained offensives against criminal groups while enhancing intelligence gathering mechanisms to address the security challenges. In a remark, chairman of the Abuja chapter of ASIS International, Edward Orim said criminal activities can only be tackled through collective participation of strategic stakeholders. Orim, who was also returned as the 2024 chairman alongside some executives, said the Abuja chapter would leverage on the success of 2023 and continue with its relationship with the FCT administration in developing policies that will strengthen security architecture of the territory. Uh, we're looking forward to partnership. We already done that earlier this year with working with uh, the FCTA. So I think uh, it will be a success where we'll try to develop policies to enable the government well support. Like you can see, the director uh, also decided to present the policies that uh, they have so that we can have an idea. And uh, I think uh, next year will be great. On his part, one of the awardees and the secretary, FCT Security Command and Control Center, Dr. Peter Olumuji, disclosed that the award was in recognition of the commitment of the FCT administration to security issues in the nation's capital. Receiving this award this uh, evening from um, ASIS International Abuja chapter shows that we recognize the good work the FCT administration has been doing and some of us have been part of that uh, good work and that's why this award has come and definitely it will spur us to do more. Me personally, I'm going to do more in terms of ensuring that Abuja uh, enforcement is tackled and do accordingly. Usman Katun Umar, Aso Television News.